ball-like, yes. is it not? Why didn't you just say it? I should have. You know, speaking of fall, I was going to say it was a autumnal. Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grilling Cookbooks are great holiday gifts. Yes, they are. And tailgating is to be had. The Brewers are going to be hot. The Packers are going to be hot. The Wisconsin Badgers. Everyone's hot. They are. Yes. They are. Yeah, it's windy out here. Did you know that? Yes, I did. I was actually uh, uh, saying that. I was uh, complaining a little bit. <laughs> this is Mad Dog, by the way. Yes. Merrill, where's Merrill? He's. Uh, that prima donna. Ah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, he's probably. I think, I think he's still putting his makeup on in that well, makeup room in there. The I, green room. I understand. Yeah. Well, that's the screen behind you. Right. Well, yeah, did you ever do angel food cake uh, on the grill? No, never. Yeah, yeah, we dipped all the edges of the angel food cake in, in Wisconsin butter. We set the grill for medium low heat. I just caramelized each and one of those edges. Yeah. And it's, it's delicious with like a, a cherry delight, uh, cherry pie filling over the top. But today we're going to take the. the, the, the cherry syrup from Cherry Delight, and I'm going to take a little drizzle. Yeah, that we're, looks good. We're going to do like a uh, uh, black forest cake. Oh, so now yeah. we have the cherry over the top of that. Yeah. And now we have uh, uh, Fat Louis dark chocolate balsamic vinegar. Oh, yeah, yeah, get out of here, I right? I like this idea. I'm so we're going to drizzle a little bit of the balsamic over the top of that just to give it that little extra flavor. Okay. And, and, and it should be delicious. It should be good. Maybe a little side of Cool Whip or ice cream with it, oh, but it's yeah. really delicious. It caramelizes gorgeously on there with the, with the butters and the sugars of the angel food cake. Uh, then we did a wonderful buffalo ribeye steak. Whole beautiful homemade carrot, not homemade, but homegrown carrots. Right. Glistened with an Italian dressing, browned up on the grill. Individual flavors. If you boil it, you spoil it. If you grill it, you put thrill into it, Pete. And. Uh you got the, you got the well, great well, well, sausage. Exactly. We're going to take a little bit of Mad Dog and Merrill's number one to finish this off. And just drizzle that nice thick barbecue sauce right on the side. Mm. And it's going to be delicious. So we yeah. have buffalo ribeye, carrots, and dessert. Now, uh, backtrack, you may have said this, but is this like indirect heating? It's It's direct method of cooking, but a real low heat. By the okay. time you put the eighth wedge on there, you start turning the other ones. Yeah, it's Because it caramelizes yeah. fast. Yeah, I don't want nobody cussing at me like they do about you about the wind. I think you were doing that last hour. I heard that. No, 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 no. About the wind? Yeah. I love the wind. All right, good. Yes. <laughs> it blows through my I hair. I think you're full of hot air, but I, I think you are. I, I, capsules tomorrow in Bailey's Harbor. Fall Fest Parade first in Sister Bay. We're going to head to capsules till 4 o'clock. Oot of a time. You can see him and you can see you live. And Merrill. Or, yeah. And you can see him well, on the CW14 Sunday. <laughs>